Okay, and welcome to another another day and another uh, episode of Let's Play Arcana. I leveled up my character some. Did the grind a little off screen. Uh, I really? Oh god, it's been so long since I played through this game. Not sure what level I really need to get through all these. I did get several levels. I didn't snag any of the items in here. So now to fill out the map, I don't think there is anything over here. Except some battles. Oh no. Oh. Still paying for those Doritos a couple days ago. Ugh. <sighs> oh jeez. Just deafened everybody. I'm telling you what, lactose intolerance is not something to mess with. Ah, let's see. Oops. Drain pass. Yeah, it's been a while since I played this. I really liked this game. Always nice to find some herb. No! Let us go first. Nope, they're gonna go first. And then my useless character goes. Ha! Yeah, Sylph is actually useful. Also improved Salah's weapon. Got her a mace. Ah, I can't go left. All right, there we go. That's odd. Usually left isn't a something on this joypad that's messed up. Yeah, since I leveled up a, a good amount, I'm just gonna go to the next areas. Oh, I probably should have hit one of those guys in the front before they all do the monkey see, monkey do lightning. Take that! Hey, you already went! Bitch. Hey, it's my turn. And then, it's my turn again. The good thing is it kind of smooths it out. You get a little extra hits from the enemy at the beginning, and then you get like two free turns in a row. It's really weird. But hey, that's just the way things go. I'd love to do a remake of this game on the PC. With modern graphics and a modern interface. Actually, no, the interface is pretty good. Ugh. Um. What I'd like to do is change the inventory system. So instead of like every item being separate, they'd be stacked. I really don't think there's a maximum amount you carry. There might be, I just. It's just not easy to reach it. Ah, good lord, somebody hit something. No, I didn't. I mean, them. Uh, uh, Alright, I said somebody hit something. And I'm the one that got hit, so. Oh well. Tough titties. They're bees, they aren't friendly. Wait a second. Did I miss a, like a big chunk in the middle or something? No, I didn't. Yeah, I tend to try to map out every little thing. I don't always 
do it like I didn't do it on the... Alright, these honeys... You always give them to rooks. You just... That's just the way you do it. Because when it comes down to it... Not to try to be a spoily spoilage... But when it comes down to the very last battle, it's rooks against the final boss, so... Plus, he's the most versatile. It actually might be a maximum that's... I really don't remember. Oh, it's where I start seeing these. Ew. Fire gel. Ah, oh, here come the... Wait, weren't these in the first dungeon? Now, the sauropods are upgrades. Ah, you ass. Those things hit hard and they go a lot. They just go constantly. Oh. Those things can rip your party apart. Come on. Take it out. Wow, there were some good, uh. scratch. Yeah, I hear something, too. Yeah, and then when you get him, he's not all that good. He's not that uber. The man. He's the man. Let's go on. He should have joined. Oh, this is a place where you... Uh, this is our grindy place. I think there, there's a... Uh, yeah, the trunk men, I think, are worth a good amount. The only thing is, I didn't buy the... Elements is strong against water. They're worth a shitload of experience. This is a great place to grind. Twenty experience and thirty gold. Eh. It's a, it's a fly trap. Not sure why it's attacking me. Not a fly, damn it. Oh, this area has a boss, too. Holy shit. Um, I can't remember what's strong against water. Uh oh. I should have attacked the one on the front. This isn't good. I might have to... ...retreat here. Ah! Uh. 
God, they hit hard. All that time I spent... Yeah, I need a couple more levels. up here somewhere. Did I miss it? No. 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 wasn't prepared. I needed to buy uh, some decent cards. That's what I needed. But I didn't do it. No, I didn't. things again, as usual. Oh well. No biggie. I might actually be able to defeat the boss. I can't remember what, uh... attribute it is. Wish I remembered the uh, quick keys for... Eh. Take that. for saving the state. I generally don't use save states, but... Be nice to be prepared just in case. I could take this boss on and see if I can do it.
too. It should be up the one that actually goes somewhere. Yeah, that's probably where the boss is. And he might be fire element. I'm just gonna go up. If I die, I die. Let's do it hardcore. No save states. <laughs> Something tells me I should probably have level 15 before I do this. I regret it. Ah, cool, he is fire. He gets to go multiple times. Ah, oh, phew. Not sure which one of these is useful. Ah, oh, come on. What is Rook stunned or something? have the cards. Awesome. I love how he's fighting naked before. Oh, magic. The good thing is, is I can now go back here and fight these guys and get a few levels and hopefully I can go back to town and stock up that's what I really need to do I need to get Darwin some better armor or some armor some actual armor I was just out of MP Ah, I pressed down like four or five times. Ah, why do you do that? Wine. <laughs> why do you do that? Ah, screw it. These guys aren't that tough. Ah, what the hell? That bee is like God. It's like the Christ bee or something. 
Tyson, I take that! He dodges. That was sucked. Stomach is still hurting from those Doritos. I don't see why they don't call it an allergy. It feels like a frickin' allergy. I mean, it's like 48 hours of agony. Take them out! Give me all that delicious experience in gold. Wow, that is a lot for one chunk. I mean, seriously, I could get a few levels here. I probably should. It's hard not to grind on this game when you really know you need the levels. Especially when you find an area that has just something worth a crap load of XP. And even more gold. <sighs> Take that, you fly trap. You flea trap. Those ones aren't worth nearly as much. They aren't nearly as uber. I just keep going until I run out of magic points, hit points. I'm sure it's what you wanted to see, a nice grind. Hey, a lot of these games I play that I really enjoy, they're like this. I mean, you have to level up. If you cut out all the grindy parts, the game's an hour long. <laughs> fun to play several times in a row, because once you really get to know them, you can, you can, uh, you get to know the area so well, you can try for low level runs. Then you don't get lost, or you know which items to pick up, which items you can just leave. I haven't played this in so long, it's kind of like playing it the first time. Although this is one I played like six or seven years ago on an emulator. Once to revisit it. I do have to say it was one of my favorites of the uh, SNES. I wonder if level 15 will be enough. I know there's a few areas I have to go through here, like a desert style one. Before I get to the final. This is a pretty big area you gotta go through. It's essentially about 
five times as large. Or, no, maybe three times as large. Their area was two levels. And they, this is uh, four levels that are a little bit bigger. Plus, we just want to keep Darwin with us as, as long as possible. He doesn't stay till the end, I don't think. I think he stays going through here. Then the next area. Then he leaves the party. Then the part where you go through the forest to meet up with uh, Rhinol, you're back to just Rook's Salon and the spirits. <clears throat> so it's good we have him to level up a little bit. It's kind of like because you don't get any less XP having more people with you. But you do get a hell of a lot more firepower. Especially since he's three levels ahead of me. It's a prime opportunity. To load up on money, experience. Cash man. Yeah, Darwin's such a badass. He has his own music. I swear, I, I swear, the music always changes to that if he's in your party. for the day what recording because I need to get a little bit more sleep. Oh, I need an overhaul on my stomach is what I need. Woo! I found my kryptonite. It's called Doritos. When I do kill them all, it's weird how there's like a combat every few seconds. But sometimes there's these huge lulls where you think the game broke. That's what I'm experiencing here. Using the oh, 
But now that I have a destination, it's like... We got you now! Hit that penis fly, fly truck. Truck man's like, oh, I'm dying. Yeah, I might as well clear out the rest of this area. Might be uh, some more money or something. I'm not sure. Take out those trunk men. And then just zap the rest of them. I said zap the rest of them. Damn it. Now I'm gonna get chewed on by a fly trap. A hundred gold. Woohoo! Later, there's a good leveling up is uh, trolls. I think worth like a hundred, hundred XP each or something in the ice mines. Then the dragons near the end. There's all prime prime areas to. Bust out the levels. These earlier ones seem a little bit more grindy because they aren't as devastating, they aren't as solid to get. Whereas with the, uh, the trolls and the Dragons. There are specific places where you can just get all of those. You get some other monsters with them, but you're pretty much guaranteed to get a troll or a dragon in their respective areas. Oh my god. My stomach's got me burping. There's some gas issues there. Oh man, they just need to frack me. I have enough natural gas in me to fuel us for a generation. Although I wouldn't say it's clean fuel. It stinks. Take that! Get out of our way! How dare you come at us one at a time? Huh, return ring. They knew people would want to go back. I'm not going back yet. Blast these guys. That's another good resource saving thing. You eventually get elementals that'll uh, heal you as well as do these damaging attacks. And they regenerate every step. As long as you don't get attacked too much, you can pretty much heal and do, you know, massively nuke. Ah, cool, I don't, I don't need return rings anymore. Not that I'm gonna sell mine. It's always good to... Ah, what's with the fucking dodging? 
What are these? The Dodgers? I just want to know, are they the ones from, uh... The old ones from Brooklyn? Or are they the new ones from L.A.? know how I know about the Brooklyn Dodgers. That was way before my time. And I'm old. Okay, I'm, I'm technically just entering middle age. I'm telling you. Especially when I do something stupid like drink milk or eat Doritos. I feel like I'm 80. Ugh. They don't teach me. They don't teach me to eat Doritos, goddammit. Oh, I wonder if I can eat bugles. I could go for some bugles right now. Alright, yippee. Get the hell... Whoa! I was like, uh, It's like that note went a little bit psycho. It's like the orchestra, one of them got a little bit, uh, overzealous. Ideally, I'd like to get rooks to 16. Ooh, and this will go a long way to doing that. Experience? Hell yeah. I'm literally gonna be shitting gold. Wow. I don't know if armor does much in this game. I mean, dude has no armor on. And he seems to be faring pretty well. Na 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 trunk man! Quit giving Sylph all the frickin' turns! Those are like the attributes are like two elements mixed or something. And I'll be damned if I know which ones are which. That one doesn't seem to do as much damage as Salah's one does. Do's. Alrighty. Stay in here where I get all the XP. The next area are all these long corridors with an item at the end of each one. And the mobs are the mobs. There are, there are no mobs in this game. None of them are mobile. The monsters are all nasty fire. They have a lot of those sorrow whatever pods and shit. That rip you a new asshole. Basically, see this asshole? This is your asshole. Shred. 
This is your new ass. They are not fun. Especially since Sylph can actually get torn to bits by them. Trunk man. I must defeat the man of the trunk. Wow, that was damn good damage. Trunk man. Die, trunk man. All right. I can't complain about that. That was a whole lot of XP and gold from one shot of lightning. Is that the best you can do? Come on, Rooks. You can do it. Time for some heal two action. There we go. Except when I'm immune to it. I holy gold. When we get back to town, Darwin, you're getting some fancy clothes. I think I can get something better for solitude. BB. Well, I think it would be funnier if they were ghosts and their names were Boo. And then you have Boo B. Ha 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 that's all fun and games till some woman sees you and smacks you in the face for it. You got a big hand print on your face. Then you'll be sorry, I tell ya. Hmm. I think I might get him level 16 and then that'll be the end of the video. Sorry it was another grinding video. Uh, wait a second. No, I'm not sorry. That's pretty much what this game is. <laughs> I'm telling you what, it's damn fun. Damn. 
funny thing about Might and Magic 3, I, I realize I think I only beat it once back in the day. World of Zine was, uh... Well, to tell you the truth, I had a really good clue book for World of Zine. I wish I hadn't lost it. Uh, the clue book for... that came from New World Computing for both World of Zine and Might and Magic 3 are terrible. I mean, they, they give you the maps, but they don't list anything in the frickin' map, like the traps or anything like that. Which is why I now remember the reason I mapped out uh, Might and Magic 3 by hand back in the day. I just don't have the space to do it now. Nor do I have the graph paper. Nor do I think people want to watch a video and just hear somebody uh, mapping something on graph paper. I just don't think that'd be as... well... yeah, it wouldn't be as exciting. Hey, it's not like an action game. I guess action games are more exciting, but damn, am I hell of a lot worse than that. I am terrible at most of them. Yeah, I remember when I used to be really good at Mega Man. I think, uh, 1, 2, and 3 on Nintendo. Those were the days. I was in my teens. I actually really enjoyed Mega Man 2. That would have been my favorite one. I always exploited games, like found ways to get almost unlimited lives. Well, in that one, I think you could only get up to nine lives or something. When the last level there was a perfect area to farm. I love this music for Darwin, though. Yeah, the original Mega Man, I really don't... I think I played at someone else's house. It's one of those games I didn't hear of it until Mega Man 2. And by that time, they didn't even frickin' sell Mega Man anymore. So it's kind of a bust, in a way. So I had to, like, borrow it. I just remember playing the hell out of two. Could have been in the 90s when I played the original one. I had a friend that had a, uh... He was a manager at a video game place. And they sold, uh, used games. And that's when I got to play a lot of Nintendo games that I had heard of but never saw anywhere. People were, like, getting rid of their Nintendo games and getting Super Nintendo and all that. So they had loads of just loose NES games. Finally! I think that's going to be a video. Rest at the inn. Get everyone their 
New turtles. Wow. Upgrade gear some. I have so much money. Wow. There's special breast mail for his breasts. Apparently he has breasts and he needs breast mail for it. I guess Rune Gauntlet. I think there's a thousand gold thing for... Yeah, Sally could use the chain mail. Defense boost. And sell that other thing. Excellent. Now to save. Now move on. Awesome. Now I'm going to call that a part, guys. I'll see you next time.